Mike, what is a special master and what is the significance of this? So a special master is someone who is appointed by a judge to assist the judge, usually with the discovery matter. And Judge Cannon, Eileen Cannon, the, from the Southern District of Florida, a federal judge down there, has said that she wants to appoint a special master to do the review of President Trump's rated records. The, the Biden Justice Department had this un unprecedented, unnecessary, unlawful home grade of a former president who happens to be the current president's chief political enemy. They took 11,000 documents from this home raid and the, they, they went to a biased magistrate judge, Bruce Reinhardt, who just recused from President Trump's civil lawsuit against Hillary Clinton on June 22nd and got him to authorize this home raid. Somehow his bias, his clear judicial bias, under 28 USC 455A and Canon 2 and Canon 2 we have the judicial canons magically disappeared over that six week period where his clear bias went away. He had a 2017 Facebook post bashing Trump. So the Biden Justice Department went down, they judge shop for this judge, got this unprecedented home raid warrant. And now Judge Cannon, I think, is on to them. Because if you look at her order where she ordered this, uh, she's said that she's going to appoint a special master she talks about, quote, the swirling allegations of bias and media leaks in this case. She talks about how the structure and operation of this raid was improper. The same prosecutors uh, who ran the Russian collusion raid are now doing this home raid of President Trump to get back these Russian collusion documents. There's not a, a wall. There's not a good wall between mm -hmm. the prosecutors and the people who are re reviewing the documents. Two documents, two privileged documents, at least two privileged documents got through this privilege review to the prosecutors and they didn't wall off the, the prosecutors from this investigation. The judge talked about the politicized circumstances of the raid. She talked about how this was extraordinary, exceptional, and how Biden, or excuse me, Trump has been cooperating with the Biden Justice Department, how Biden was the one who, who authorized this home raid, uh, and that uh, these this home raid raises serious legal issues including the fact what we've been talking about, Charlie, from day one, the president has the absolute constitutional power to declassify anything he wants, and yes. he has the sole statutory power to take personal records with him to Mar-a-Lago.